from Sky Sports reporter revealing that Newcastle United are set to beat Tottenham Hotspur to Leicester City star James Madison. Are you sure about that? It would be Newcastle, which means Newcastle. To the Toon Army submitting an offer for a Juventus midfield superstar. To Fabrizio Romano, revealing a new shock twist in the Sobosly saga. What? To Newcastle making a smart loan deal with Dutch champions Feyenoord. As well as eyeing a Champions League semi-finalist superstar to partner with Bruno Guimaraes. Howe's Newcastle United are said to beat Tottenham Hotspur to the signing of Leicester City star James Madison. According to Sky Sports reporter Rob Dorsett, Tottenham is unwilling to pay the salary that Madison wants, while the Magpies are prepared to shell out for the midfielder's big wages. It's no secret that Newcastle has more financial clout than Tottenham, but the reports on Madison's next destination have been mixed. One minute, the London club is leading the race, and the next, there's a sudden twist as a move to St. James Park gains momentum, as confirmed by transfer expert Dorset. For the Toon Army faithful, this news is music to their ears. With an already strong midfield, adding a player like Madison would elevate their Wabitwan even further. The same is true for Spurs, who have been looking for a replacement for Christian Eriksen since his departure to Inter in 2020. However, Leicester City is likely to demand a fee in excess of £60 million for the 26-year-old midfielder, according to Dorset. He also noted that Madison is worth more than £50 million, but with one year left on his contract, his value has decreased. Leicester pays big salaries, and Madison is no exception. If he moves to another club, he will expect to earn at least the same amount. It's unlikely that Tottenham will be willing to pay the salary that Madison wants. I don't think you have the facilities for that big man. You're broke! Which makes Newcastle the front runner. Wow! Dorset has a gut feeling that Newcastle will come in for Madison and be prepared to pay the money because he is a player in a position that they don't have. The question on everyone's mind is whether Madison is a Champions League level midfielder. He has been outstanding for Leicester City scoring 23 goals during his last two campaigns from the middle of the park. However, the Foxes have not played at the Champions League level, and last season, they had a disappointing campaign by going down. With Newcastle set to play against the Elite next season, Madison deserves his chance to prove that he is a Champions League quality player. In further exciting transfer news for Newcastle United, reports suggest that the club has already made an offer for Adrian Rabiot, the free agent midfielder who currently plays for Juventus in Italy. Rabiot has been a regular for Juventus in the 2022-23 season, producing the best campaign of his career for the club, with eight goals and four assists in 32 games. Despite playing a similar number of matches for Juventus over the last four seasons, Rabiot has never produced as many goal contributions for them in the league. His non-penalty goal rate of 0.25 per 90 minutes placed him within the top 4% of midfielders across the men's top 5 big leagues in Europe in that stat. This indicates that Rabiot is one of the most clinical options in his position and has the ability to get forward into advanced positions and find the back of the net for his team from the center of the field. With Rabiot's contract expiring and Juventus yet to agree fresh terms with the Frenchman, he could be available on a free deal this summer. The Toon have already tabled an offer, believed to be worth around 5 million euros per season, to try and bring the player to England. Although this figure is less than what Rabiot is currently earning in Italy, approximately 5.9 million euros, it could be just a tester offer. CIS Football Observatory suggests that Rabiot's value is currently around 50 million euros, making the prospect of signing him on a free transfer a significant coup for Newcastle United. The midfielder's talent has also earned him praise from former player Rio Ferdinand, who described him as seriously talented and brilliant at carrying the ball. Moreover, Rabiot has Champions League experience from his days with both PSG and Juventus, which could prove invaluable for Newcastle United as they look to compete at the highest level next season. If the tune can secure his signature, it would be a significant boost to their midfield 
and further evidence of their ambition to build a squad capable of challenging the top teams in the Premier League. Then moving on, Newcastle United has been in the market for a difference maker in the final third, and Dominic Soboslai has been one of the club's top targets. However, the Hungarian's 60 million euros release clause has been a sticking point for the club, and they don't believe he is worth that much. RB Leipzig, Zoboschlei's current club, has made it clear that they would only sell him if someone pays the clause in full. However, there's a shock new twist in the Zoboschlei saga. According to transfer expert Fabrizio Romano, the midfielder's 60 million euros release clause is only valid until June 30th, contrary to initial reports that it was valid until July 15th. This gives Leipzig the opportunity to increase their asking price for the attacking midfielder very soon. Newcastle needs to act fast if they are serious about signing Soboschlei. With his release clause due to expire at the end of this month, the club needs to make a decision quickly. If they don't activate his release clause this month, they risk Leipzig asking for whatever figure they want from July onwards. No, God, please, no, no! Of course, there's a chance that Soboschlei could still go for less after June 30th. Ah, you're teasing me, naughty, naughty. But it would be a surprise to see Leipzig suddenly lower their asking price. It will likely depend on how desperate they are to sell this summer. Newcastle's pursuit of Soboschlei is shaping up to be a high-stakes game, and the club needs to make a move soon. If they can secure the midfielder's signature, it would be a massive coup for the club, and a signal of their ambition to compete with the top teams in the Premier League. Then finally, prepare to be blown away <laughs> as Newcastle has made a smart loan deal with Dutch champions Feyenoord, as well as eyeing a Champions League semi-finalist superstar to partner with Bruno Guimaraes and take their game to the next level. To find out, click the video on your screen now.